What are you guys talking about? Okay, all right. If you had the choice of either saving a thousand random people anywhere in the world, you may or may not know them, or the entire race of pandas from going extinct, which would you choose to save? People, easy. Uh, what have pandas ever done for me? Uh, stupid, primitive, fuzzy balls. Fuzzy balls? I won't. No, no! I save the people. After all, we have to protect our own species. Anyone else is a traitor to the human race. Uh, uh, I disagree. Uh, I think I'd choose to save the pandas. I mean, the damage for, to the ecosystem from a loss of pandas could be devastating. Excuse me? What? How could you contradict me in public like that? I... I'm so embarrassed. What did I do? Girls, QWERTY. Much to learn you still have. Can you believe him? He's my boyfriend. He's supposed to support me with everything. How I don't get how he can just discredit me like that. That jerk. He thinks he's so smart with his suspenders and his dorky pants and his glasses. I could just. Ah, <clears throat> this is your first fight, isn't it? How adorable. What? Uh, sorry. I mean, am I being totally unreasonable? I'm sorry, I still think this whole thing is adorable. I mean, I mean, first nerd love, and, and then nerd dating, and now nerd fights. I love nerds. I love nerds, too. Guess whose prominence on the front page of this month's school newspaper? That's right, yours truly. Rudolph Baines Burger. Why? Did you kill someone? Kill someone? No. Kill the state standardized tests? Yes! I got the presidential scholarship, and I'm going to have my first year of college paid in full. So? I'm, I'm famous in a room of nobody, son. Here, here's a picture of me shaking hands with the principal. What's the caption say? What? Principal Fisher congratulates Rudolph Berghead. They spelled my name wrong? How dare they? Who's the editor of this trashy newspaper? Ha, ah, Berghead. How's your head, Berghead? Ha. Ah. What did I do wrong? QWERTY, when you date a girl, they expect certain things from you. Certain things that may seem completely ridiculous and crazy to us guys, but seems perfectly normal to them. Really? Yeah, and one of those things is they expect you to agree with them, especially in public. Otherwise, they're gonna get mad. And if you don't actually agree, agree with them, just, just keep your mouth shut. Wow, I really messed up then. Cordy, that's why we have chocolate and flowers. Giving Cordy relationship advice is interesting. It's like teaching physics to a cheerleader. When they say girls are from another planet, they are joking. You'll be fine, Cordy. Get over there. Oh. Oh. Uh, um, I'm, I'm, sorry. I'm so, sorry, Becky. I, I shouldn't have disagreed with you like that. Listen, Cordy. I think I was wrong. Becky. No, really. Just because you're my boyfriend doesn't mean you have to agree with everything I say. We are individuals, after all. That's true, but I, I feel bad about disagreeing with you so fast in front of everyone. I mean, just because I disagree with you doesn't mean I don't support you. We can still disagree about certain things and support each other, right? Right. <laughs> God, I'm so lucky I have you. Me too, Becky. I'm sorry. Me too. Another crappy day down the tubes. I mean, the school newspaper got my name wrong. 
How hard is it to get burger right? It's a German name passed out.